Hey guys, it's uh, 5.30 in the morning. I have a ninja competition coming up soon, so I can't go and work out because i got to rest. So, um, I'm up and I'm going to film an unboxing of an Apple TV refurbished I got the other day. Because I want to, and I can. So we're starting with this box. So the first thing you'll notice about this box is that it has four sides. Not all boxes are like this. Most of them are, but not all. So I'm going to take my Batman knife. Look out, cat. TV. So this is a refurbished one, so you'll see Apple certified refurbished. Because I wanted to save twenty dollars, because why not? Here you see the actual Apple TV. Nice wraps, nice and fancy. Remote, again, nice and wrapped, no scratches. Nice little packet, charging cable for the uh, remote, and power cord. Now, these don't come with um, HDMI cables, so it's important that you don't buy them from the Apple Store because they're really expensive for some reason because they think their HDMI cords are magical and produce unicorns. Instead, I just get mine off of Amazon. Amazon Basics, much cheaper. I already have one set up over here in my TV. Let's get started. So, I got my TV right here. I'll get this remote. And take off the plastic casing. Starting with the outside one right here. There's a clear case. Really good quality, not scratch or anything like that. Peel off the bottom. Plug in the power first. Pull this little sneaky back one off. It actually goes around the entire device, I think. Yeah. Just like it was new. Oh. Huh. Beautiful off this cord, put it in there nice and snug, plug in the HDMI, and then I gotta plug in the power. Alright, so once you plug it in, we'll get to this screen right here. You just grab your remote, it's gonna be in a bunch of different lang languages, I'm pretty sure it's just telling you to press the center of the touchpad. Got to select where you're from. The United States. I'm going to use Siri. Let's try set up with device. Nice. So all I had to do was unlock my iPhone. And this pops up. As long as your Bluetooth's on, you're connected to Wi-Fi, it does that apparently. I'm going to hit set up. Setting up your Apple TV. I'm skipping a minute because it's going to space. Alright, and we're back. So it's successfully set up. Um, now it's just going to ask when I require a password. I'm not going to have a require password because I'm the only one ever on this one. Um, I'm going to go ahead and enable location services as well. Automatically download my screensavers. You know what? I'll be nice. I'll let them use my diagnostic footage or data. 
and I'll share with app developers too. Terms and conditions. I'm not gonna read that because I'm normal. I'll agree to them. Boom! Now I got my Apple TV. I can download all my apps from the App Store right here, and I'm good to go. Works beautifully, so I definitely suggest buying Apple TV refurbished. You can't get it in the store, but you can order it online, and it was 20 bucks cheaper for this and it's just like new so I would definitely do that uh, if you have the option